And for our application, we have 71 out of 100, which is the same thing as 71 percent, because per means out of, cent means 100, and 71 hundredths, because this is the tenths place value, and this is the hundredths place value, meaning anything in this number is how many we have of equal groups of 10, a whole that's been cut up into 10, and here we have how many we have out of a group that's been cut up into 100. So we have seven equal groups of holes that have been cut up into 10, and here we have one little lonely, lonely guy right there that is cut up into 100. So he's in the hundreds place value. Now, can we simplify this? I asked you at the beginning to think about it, and I should have heard through the cyberspace there a resounding no, Mr. Hoche, because 71 is prime. If you didn't know that, I hope you went through your toolbox and your progressions. Dividing it by 2, dividing it by 3, dividing it by 5, dividing it by 7, dividing it by 11, and dividing it by 13. Those are your simple, basic uh, prime numbers to see if you can't figure out what, um, um, what factors could go into them. But anyway, 71's prime. It's at its simplest form. Pretty cool. Hey, just kind of think, this is a pretty big number to be in simplest form. For those of you that are that are that um, that want a challenge, what is the biggest number I'm going to have, the biggest percent, fraction, and decimal that I won't be able to simplify? Is it 71? Because I can't simplify it because it's prime. 71 is prime. So what is the biggest uh, fraction we are going to come up with before we get to the whole uh, and the 100th day of school, what's the biggest fraction we're going to get that we can't simplify?